All right, we're back. So uh, good time to uh, talk about making another drink. So we've enjoyed the auction so far, and now we're joined by Lindsay. Lindsay is Hi, the everyone. Hey, Lindsay's a marketing manager at Anglers, and uh, so glad to have you. So they've been mixing drinks while we've been <laughs> listening to the auction here, and they've mm -hmm. come up with one that we think you might like. So why don't you guys tell us about it? Yeah, so we are super excited about our growing selection of whiskeys, bourbons, so and ryes at Anglers. And um, Bridget here is the expert. So we are going to show you how to make a Manhattan. And she's going to walk us through it. Well, the interesting part of tonight is that we are doing it with two Widow Jane yeah. products. So one is the 10-year bourbon, and one is the Applewood aged rye so super exciting we have available the combo pack so you can try them both um, we also obviously have them available in the full size bottles as well if you know that you prefer one over the other but i think tonight um bridget's going to try the rye and i'm going to try the 10 year aged bourbon right yeah okay let's do it. it all right talk us through it bridget so we're doing two parts of whiskey. Okay. So this 10 year aged bourbon that I'm pouring here is 91 proof. Lucky for me, it says it right on the label. So I don't have to try to do math like Sean and Bridget <laughs> earlier today. It's 45.5% um, <laughs> ABV, which is 91 proof. All right, so I'm not getting into that. I know. <laughs> so I two know parts bourbon <laughs> in mine, two parts rye in yours. What's next? We're doing one part sweet vermouth. All right, so we have sweet vermouth right here. We will add that. How many ounces? In. One ounce. Correct. I'm not the math person. <laughs> you don't need the shot glass. You have your own. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is the fun part about anglers. Oh. Next step, do you remember? Is the bitters. bitters. Yes. And then your special touch. Well, you skipped over the orange The orange bitters. bitters. That's your special touch. Because that's not right from what I've been told by the, ex the experts touch. here. The experts here, Sean and Bridget, have told me <laughs> that orange bitters don't go in a normal Manhattan typically. Correct. Correct. But we thought... It, well, you thought because you're the bourbon the expert. I'm learning from you. Um, in the, the whiskey. Yeah. yeah. It, you know, we played off of that in our first cocktail portion. Mm -hmm. uh, the citrus enhances. That exactly. first cocktail was amazing. Yeah, I hope you guys tried it at home. <laughs> like the orange and the cherry and the apple cinnamon. That's a phenomenal. Sean yeah. Well done, special. Sean. Uh, minus the math, but <laughs> cocktail making. Very good. Um, so we're adding a little bit of bitters, which is what would typically go into a regular Manhattan, right? And now we're going to add the We're making bitters. it Eastern Shore. Yes. We're making yeah, it yeah, yeah. Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so just a touch of the orange bitters as well. Okay, and now we stir. And then uh, the bitters, add a little bit of ice. Okay, there's some ice for you, Bridget. And now this is where things Just might enough to make might cold. get tricky. Strain. Okay. We'll see how they turn out. So I'll grab. So then we need to do the orange twist. Can you handle a nice one? Zay? I don't know. We're going to find out. <laughs> yeah, like Sean said in the last video, like smelling those orange citrus oils that really <laughs> add something. Move on to the garnish. So we have our cherries, which we showed you in the first cocktail. But we've got something a little extra special for Maryland and the Chesapeake Bay and Eastern Shore. What do we have over there, Bridget? Something called a Smith Island mm. cake. I'm from Virginia. <laughs> I was not aware of this. It's a big deal in Maryland. How long have you lived in Maryland? 
You should be more aware of this. I <laughs> don't want to. I don't want to get into that legally. Yeah. <laughs> but um. So we have some Smith Island cake. Decadent. So delicious. So we are going to take our cherry. I'm gonna take like the biggest piece possible because that means I get to eat it when we're done. Right? So. <laughs> Good put strategy, the, put the cherry on there, and there we go. Use a tray. Cheers. You got the bigger cake. <laughs> Why do you think I picked my piece first? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you need to try the yum. Fantastic. You need to try this, though. Yeah. I almost they're, really they're enjoy how the cake is in Very, the very good. <laughs> <laughs> So, hope, hope you <laughs> Mine's better. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. <laughs>